A step up from the simple battery timer is the Galcon multi-zone controller. Again battery operated, a single 9 volt battery will last the whole season. But it has additional features. Apart from the four start times per day, daily watering or every other day or once a week watering, whatever you choose, and a manual override, it also has the ability to connect a rain sensor. This makes it fully weather sensitive and a very versatile unit. So waterproof is it, you can actually immerse it in water and it will still be okay, which makes it ideal for fitting in underground valve chambers. You can locate it alongside an outdoor tap if you want to, or you can fix it directly on the valve. You'll notice on this type that the valve is separate from the controller itself. If you want to fit the valve directly onto the tap, remember it's one inch, and most outlets of taps are three quarter, so we need to use an adapter, which is one of these. That screws onto the tap, and you will need some PTFE thread, thread tape to make sure it seals correctly. The valve itself screws onto that, and again, you will need PTFE tape in order to do it. Now we've fitted the valve to the tap outlet, we need to decide what the outlet connection is going to be. Remember that's one inch female, so we need to put an adapter in to whatever we're going to connect to. If it's a DB valve, for example, you want a three quarter male. If it's a compression fitting, it would just select the one inch size. In this case, we're going to use a uh, one inch to three quarter adapter, which will get us back on to the normal tap type fittings. You must use a bit of PTFE tape. and We use the gas quality tape, which enables us to seal it very quickly and efficiently. So we screw that into the outlet. And now we have a three quarter male, just exactly the same as on the tap itself. And then we'll just screw in, in this case, a quick coupling hose connector. To connect a rain sensor to a multi-zone controller is very, very simple. The two yellow wires coming from the controller are connected into the two wires of a normally open mini-click rain sensor, such as this. Mount the rain sensor in a suitable position. It's going to get rainfall, obviously. And the beauty of this is it's adjustable. So you can adjust the amount simply by turning of how much rainfall will then switch off the system. Once that rain has fallen, the micro switch operates and the controller will switch off so it won't irrigate when it's pouring down with rain. If you're using an irrigation system directly off the mains water supply, there is going to be a limit to how much water flow is available. So what happens if you've got a big garden with lawns, borders or hanging baskets all needing watering? Well, this is where the Galcon multi-zone controller really comes into its own because you can have up to four separate zones fitted to one controller. In this configuration, we've got two zones coming directly off the tap. But you could also wall mount it, having a flexible link from the end of the manifold up to the outlet of the tap. But better still, you could put your valves in an underground valve chamber. This keeps the valves out of the way, out of sight, but also remember that the controller is totally waterproof which means it's quite safe inside a valve chamber.